One step further, so you yeah. have a positive test. Yeah, yeah, I know it would be nice when we yeah. see the scan the baby back yeah. next time, okay? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So you did very well anyway, okay? So you responded, you know, you, the, for the situation of science. So this is what you want to see. Okay. Okay. okay, so started with small and then it's going nicely up. So it was absolutely good, good number of eggs. So it's, yeah. it's and they did the XC, yeah? Yeah. There are my nice photos, but you know them. So they did this intracytoplasmic sperm injection, yeah? yeah? Okay. Sperm wasn't so good, okay? So I, I'm thinking about because on the NHS referral, you had this 6.8 million, over, almost 7 million per minute, which low, but they say, okay, we can deal with it. But yeah, on that, Day. I'm going to show you maybe on this. It's yours, yeah. So I know it's it's handwriting, but <laughs> so they're writing uh, on that day the uh, numbers. So it was 0 0.1 million per milliliter. So it was very low, low number. All right. Okay. okay. But yeah, for X, it's okay. I am in just in my hand, so you never had any investigation why you had this low number of No, scores, they got to the high number and they just they left it they and left they it, yeah. I kept mm -hmm. asking them to do something but no they one weren't they interested. weren't interested in me. Yeah. Uh, it's just you know, because if there is something wrong then maybe they can have yeah. or the at least thing, you know what is yeah. the problem. The only thing I had done was they checked a bit of an ultrasound on the tubes to see if they were blocked. Yeah. But there was nothing wrong there. Okay, so they did minimum that, death one, yeah. so you investigate you, so you would not have any tumor, it's not just nothing in your yeah. testes, so they did this investigation and the, the ultrasound just, that yeah. they, the blood vessels are fine, not uh, dilated, and that it's, you know, when it's the blood vessels too big and they are not good oh, flow okay. inside as you know in your yeah. in your legs or something so very very yeah. okay we, we say very coxial or how can I say in english i don't know <laughs> it's latin I, in my head it's latin so so it's not okay so it's fine yeah. what they can check more they can check your testosterone or hormone levels okay so there is normal or maybe yeah. not or they can check some chromosomes why they are don't do it is because it's it's very expensive. But okay. if somebody yeah. has a low number of sperm, it should be should be checked. Yeah, yeah. I, had, I did have blood tests, but they never came back to me with any oh. problems. Okay. So I did blood ask for the results. It's maybe but for for hormones or. Uh, I think it was for. The testosterone. I don't know. The they testosterone. never. They never told me. I asked them, "Is there any problem?" And they just said no. And they they written this six point eight million. So okay, it's just uh, you know uh, we had embryos. It's fine. It's just if you want to know why or yeah. if it's something wrong, then yeah. so very low chance. But for example, what can be wrong? Can be wrong some chromosomes problem. Okay, is the problem if there is any chromosome problem with you? Then then is in the in the embryos maybe. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. The problem is, under NHS, we cannot do anything, so they are not paying to check the embryos right. for yeah. genetically, but uh, private, we can, yeah. okay? okay. Or, or if you have any gene of, for, for example, the cystic fibrosis, if there is a gene in you, then it could cause low number of sperms, and then we can check in the embryos again, okay. not under NHS, yeah. but we can do something. So it's just if you want, yeah, it's maybe it would be nice to have. So if somebody has lower than 5 million per milliliter, or definitely lower than mm. 1 million per milliliter, then it should do this investigation. Yeah. And you should, so they, sh they should do under NHS, I know NHS no money, but they, they mm. should yeah. do, so if you want, I can write in the letter for the GP, then you should have this investigation, and then it takes time, it takes yeah. time, so yeah. it will be not tomorrow, I know. 
still we have embryos, so we can carry on with the with the treatment because NHS we can't do anything else under okay. NHS. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Everyone. Okay. So, so hopefully you will be a healthy pregnancy and that's it. And then then it's everything yeah. ticked because if you have a healthy baby, then everything ticked. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Just worst scenario, we used all of the embryos and there is no pregnancy or maybe yeah. miscarriage or something like this. Then, then we still not have information why it's happening. Okay? Yeah, hopefully. Okay. So just have a silly question: Can that be privately funded at this point to find out that answer? Uh, it's just a problem. Till still you are under NHS, oh, NHS we cannot yeah. do anything privately. So okay. it's the problem. Right. Okay. Yeah, okay. so you can go somewhere else to do this test without our knowledge, <laughs> and then okay. you can bring this test. But I cannot send you anywhere. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Right. Yeah. So there is a lab, uh, TD at the doctor laboratory in in um, um, London, okay. which is doing all of the tests that you need normally. Okay. okay. Mm. If you want, they are yeah expensive t yeah. Uh, chromosomes, and it takes time. It's minimum a month or six six weeks to come back the result. But at least you know then you are fine. Okay, it's just yeah. if I were you, yeah. but is yeah okay. So I would like yeah. to know that I'm fine, and then yeah, we mm -hmm. use the embryos, and we are fine because embryos should be okay anyway. You are young, yeah. so it's the genetic, any other genetic problem, it's it's very low. Okay. Okay, just because yeah yeah, well, I. I cannot help you in this because That's you are fine. here That's under right. NHS, so yeah. I can and I can yeah. I can offer you everything without paying. But this one I cannot offer you yeah. without paying. So we can okay. do a TSH test which is fifty pounds, but I cannot uh, offer you this one okay. unfortunately. I would <laughs> like but I, I cannot. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I will write in the letter for your GP. Is the same GP for you? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. yeah. Okay. Can, are you happy if, if I write and you yeah, need a yeah. urological investigation and what yeah. I test and then yeah, yeah. You, you can ask your GP and then if they are not happy then yeah but okay. we have embryos so we can do the frozen embryo transfer for you but they are writing nicely so they put back it was a top quality embryo yeah okay. so we don't know why it's not yeah Something maybe not good with the embryos, something else, we don't know. But you have this 3BB and 4BB and another 3BB in the storage. Let's just check it. This, this. Yeah, 3BB. It was transferred. Oh, no, the four, oh, the 4BB was transferred to the 4C and, and this one. So these three in the storage. Okay? Okay. So. They separately frozen, so we can put back only one. So we can unfreeze one. If it survived, we put back. Okay. 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 <clears throat> and the frozen embryo transfer, it's much much easier for you. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's not need stimulation drugs. Okay. So we don't okay. give you anything. It will be not bloated, not yes, yes. Okay. No air collection. Okay. Only just a transfer. And what okay. we are doing, we give you. Not, not so many folic acid in the ovary, so we give you only tablets for the okay. lining. Okay, yeah. so you will let us know the day one, day two we do a scan, laser scan, check everything fine, no cyst, lining it's coming out. Yeah, then you will start tablets only, okay. and then a week later you will come back to check your lining. Okay, okay. if it's ready. We will discuss. If it's not ready, we, we will do another scan a few days later. Okay. Lining ready. You will start the progesterone, this nice uh, yeah. pesaris, yeah. okay? Because you have to be five days on the progesterone and then we can put right. the embryo, okay? okay? So you will start the pesaris and five days later we say, okay, this day the embryo transfer day. On that morning, the embryologist will unfreeze one of these embryos, okay. okay? And in the afternoon or somewhere in the day, we will put back, okay. okay? Yeah. If maybe that embryo could not survive this freezing unfreezing procedure, which is very low chance of it will, then they will call you and ask you, you have two more embryos, are you happy to unfreeze the okay. same? And they will unfreeze on that day, okay? okay. Another embryo, okay? Right. But hopefully, it will be only one. Yeah. And please put back, and the other two is still yeah. in the storage. Okay. okay. So, say the worst is to happen, and they end up unfreezing all three, and they don't survive the unfreezing. 
would this still be a round of the NHS IVF gone, or would we just... These frozen embryo transfer are definitely under NHS. I, I have to ask just it's the co uh, my colleague who is doing this at NHS something is not here now, but okay. uh, we will ask because they do two fresh cycles, but we don't know how many frozen. So normally they return so two fresh plus two frozen or what's right. happening. Okay. okay. So you have I think yeah. yeah, but if they just didn't return here, so I have okay. to I have to ask. That's for the right anything. So I think it's too too fresh, too frozen. Okay. If this is the situation, yeah. <coughs> then you had the one fresh already, yeah. and then we do the first frozen transfer for you. Okay. If it's not successful, because you have more frozen embryos, we have to use first the frozen. So we okay. will do the second yeah. frozen embryo transfer right. for you. Okay. And. Uh, And if it's too fresh or too frozen, that means four frozen embryo transfers. So I think we can use all of the frozen embryos, but minimum right. two, minimum okay. two frozen. Okay? Yeah. okay. And then if it's no more NHS funded cycle, but you still have an embryo in the storage, then you can pay for it after that as private. Okay. Fine. Okay. okay. What would yeah. be the price of? Because if it, if we're not going through all the retrieval, would it, is there a difference in price on? On the what, so you mean if we use up the yeah. NHS so and stuff and then have to go So would the, all the eggs yeah. be used up? So with the NHS, the, you can have two fresh, but still you have frozen embryos, we cannot do the fresh. Okay, yeah. so this is how NHS, yeah. Yeah. Uh, because it's the, the frozen, it's, yeah, it's less money. So so they uh, they not allowed us to to do another fresh cycle for you till yeah. you have embryos in the storage, okay? okay? So it's a high chance that you have no more fresh cycles under NHS, but we can put back the frozens for you. Okay. okay? Fine. Yeah. Um, am I able to request, so I know that this one was a failed pregnancy. When I go back for the transfer, can I ask for two to be put back in, or is it best to just have one? <laughs> First, we protect one. Okay. okay, in your age, fine. we always prefer the, the one. one. Okay, okay. Fine. Uh, if so, in your age, definitely. Okay, okay. and uh, but if maybe the this one, if it's not successful and you have not baby in your hand after that, yeah. and you left two embryos, maybe we can put back the second for the second one too. Okay, okay? yeah, but That's normally fine. we prefer the single one. embryo transfer because yeah. we don't want the or multiply yeah. and six, well. okay? Yeah, I know, I know, but there is a risk with this, yeah, okay? I so, know. Yeah, and this fine. is for you as well, okay? Yeah. Not just for the yeah. baby, the baby is a for you, yeah. okay? So, so if we can avoid, that's we fine. want. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. yeah, okay? So first, definitely, we will put back one of these. The embryo just knows which, uh, which is the best one, okay? So they know which one, one of these three will be will increase, but okay. they know they so they have a a list which is the first second one. <laughs> okay. They know this. Okay. Yeah. So, but it's very good. Uh, we have very good results with frozen transfers. Okay. okay. So don't worry. It's the yeah. same or a little bit higher risk than in a yeah. fresh. Okay. So okay. it's really good results. Okay? okay. Fine. We are doing now for for private patient. We can offer the that package. Then we do a collection, freeze all the embryos and put back just frozen embryos for them. So we are very confident with the frozen embryo transfer. Okay? okay. Yeah. So don't worry about this. It's not less chance, definitely. Okay. okay. Yeah. I mean, could it be my fault as to the failed pregnancy? No. Okay. No. A okay. big no. Okay? <laughs> no, no, don't blame okay. yourself. You cannot do anything wrong. Okay? Okay, fine. Yeah, it could be then your immune system or something but it's not because you know you okay. did something or you didn't yeah. something okay? okay so don't fine. blame yourself it's not okay. depend on you okay okay it's very yeah. low chance you are young so this has any problem okay the immunology is very gray area still okay, okay. fine so sometimes we keep prednisolone but it's not i mean steroids to push down the immune system but it's not really strong evidence that they they okay. have or they have more harm okay yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, if you want something plus, we can try. It's still not strong evidence that yeah. the little, uh, the small, the baby aspirin, it helps the 
the better circulation. Okay. okay. So taro is behind is a better circulation yeah. and better lining. Okay? okay. So you can have this 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 seventy five milligram. Right. Okay. Aspirin once a day. Right. Okay. okay. Fine. Bad. Could help. Yeah. Could not. But uh, could okay. Not, but it's not harm. Yeah. But steroid is harm. Okay. So okay. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Uh, do you think I'm going to have to go up to three pessaries on this cycle rather than the two? We normally give yeah. for the frozen okay. three. Okay. okay, fine. Yeah. Yeah. This is the normal. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's three. fine. Three. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's enough for an elephant, if I'm honest with you, but it's okay. We use, so it's not, it's not as the other drugs, if you take more, then it could cause any problem. It's yeah. just come out. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. the progesterone, it's doesn't matter how. Okay. Okay. That's fine. So we can use three. But okay. for a fresh, we, we use two. So it's absolutely okay. fine. Okay. Fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, would I be better doing the pessaries anally rather than vaginally? It doesn't matter. It's doesn't dependent matter. Okay. on Okay. 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 Fine. Both, uh, yeah. both parts, it's absorbed very well. Okay. okay. Fine. It's really depend on you. Yeah. You just ask before the transfer to use rectally on that morning. Okay. But fine. after that, or before that, it's depend on you. Okay, fine. Yeah. I just wasn't sure if maybe I had irritated the nuts no. by it. Okay, fine. I can't do anything wrong. Don't oh, okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't blame yourself. Please. <laughs> Honestly. Okay. It's just the chances. It's biology, you know. Yeah, it's not okay. 100%. So yeah. You are a young couple, looks everything yeah. fine, but we still don't know what's happening with the embryos or what's happening. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, it's that's not fine. you. Okay? okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's just this investigation because I can see, but it's not, yeah. it could be an absolute, I have seen lots of babies and they are adults now with the same semen. Okay? Okay. So fine. it's, it's. It's not the, not this the problem if we do the the XC. Just you need yeah. this XC procedure. That's it. Okay. Okay. Fine. But it's just because we have this uh, some investigation, not a lot, but some investigation that we can do. On the other side, for example, for the immune system, we have uh, not too many things yeah. to do. Okay. So this is yeah. why I told you, and it's it's okay. Yeah. With, with six or seven million, we don't. So that came back okay. as point one. So yeah. point yeah, on that day. Okay. So it okay. was really low. Okay. Yeah. So, so what's the name of the place that we can go to to get Richard tested? It's for the GP first, and the GP should refer okay. you to the okay. urologist. Okay. And okay. the urologist can ask because this is a low number of sperms uh, for this investigation. So. Yeah, they okay. have to investigate, I mean, examine you, and they have to do the hormone tests or, and the chromosomes tests. Would it be quicker for us to go off our own back and go privately? To maybe, get it's quick, maybe it's, 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 okay. yeah, it's quicker, but just ask the GP. You okay. cannot lose anything, and then, yeah, yeah, that's true. yeah. And and then if, if it's too long or... They've not been tested. Yeah. They've been quite quick, haven't they? Yeah, that's that. true. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. we had these results, and then it's dropping, or, you know, so yeah. you can, it's just, maybe it was just that day, and the other yeah. day it's better, but still, yeah. still not so good. Yeah, so if. You can have this yeah. investigation, maybe it's just benefit for yeah. to have, okay, I'm fine, can yeah. you use your sperm because it's absolutely fine, we just need this luck to continue, yeah. okay? okay? I just don't find that if it's something, if it's, it's yeah. you know, that is, it, it just cause we put back and that is miscarriages or that, everything, yeah. so it's, it's, yeah, you know, it's not. Yeah, yeah, when it's that low, does it normally mean that there's something wrong? Or can it be just that low and yeah, and that's just it? Yeah, okay. just we have this. So if it's something wrong with in this part, chromosomes or CC fibroids or anything, that we we should we know. Okay? okay. There is another. There is a chromosome test when we <coughs> know that there is you know uh, forty six chromosomes we have and it's normal. Okay. And there is another test when we just check the Y chromosomes because sometimes. Um, if the father has low number of sperms, it, it, it is going to the Y chromosome something, and if it's Y, we say deletion on that. And then if you have a boy, a, a son, okay, then it could be the same problem. It's just you should know. But that's okay. it. 
uh, Cassie as you. Okay, so it's just could be the maybe the same problem. Of okay. Right, because a girl doesn't want that. Okay. Well, she hasn't got yeah. Y chromosome. So okay. Yeah. So it's just good to know, but that's it. Okay. Okay. And there is okay. just we normally or the amateurs should do this investigation if it's low. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Is it normally a genetic thing for the low sperm, or is could it be? Oh, this, okay. this one is could be a genetic right, thing. Okay. And the, uh, the Y, Y right, chromosomes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Maybe nothing. I don't want to press you. Okay. No, Sorry. No, no, it's no, just. No, no, it's fine. just. Uh, this yeah. is what we can do, and a lot of yeah. things we cannot because we have no clue. I mean, the science. Yeah. I'm honest with you. So, yeah. um, you say that you're going to give us a thing to take to a doctor to yeah I will write a letter yeah All right. okay. and Thank send you. it to you and to the GP oh, okay in the same time That's okay great. so yeah. when you have the letter then the GP yeah, yeah. The right. okay Thank great you. thank you very much okay but yeah. uh, if you want to start so you had this period is finished now uh, yeah okay yeah. so you will have next one somewhere in the beginning of uh, I think my period that how, how this do is you another question yeah so my cycle was around 30 days yeah so is my period going to be different this month because of everything i went through with the IVF? no no it's come back it so when was okay. when started so your period? I started first. around the first. first okay so um, so around the 30th i'll be due. should be somewhere here okay, okay it should fine. become a normal okay, okay fine. so if you have a period here and you want to start that's mean we will put back the, the frozen embryo somewhere in the middle or okay 20th of may then we can start if you okay. want okay um, if you want to wait more it's absolutely fine okay, okay. no rush yeah. embryo frozen doesn't matter how long okay, okay. so the next question is so say i'm a little bit late and i don't come on until like the say i come on on the yeah. friday the third what would happen there because you will call us or if it's a weekend you will call Harley Street and you can go to Harley Street for a scan. Okay. From Harley Street we're working. Okay. Okay. Fine. And the same as a bank holiday Monday. Yeah. I would we were on the Saturday. Yeah. 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 Okay. So you're here on bank holiday Monday. No. No. Harley Street. Harley Street. Okay. Harley Street. okay. Right. The fine. weekends or bank holiday in Harley Street. Harley Street. Okay. Yes, fine. Yeah. But we can start the treatment for you. Okay. okay? So it's no problem. You yeah. will go there for a scan and then you will start the tablets and you will have the scans after that. Okay. okay. Great. And yeah. on the day the embryo transfer, Harley Street. Harley Street. Yeah. yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. Thank you. Okay. So, but if you want to wait because June is better for you, it's okay. Okay. So okay. it's no rush. Okay. It's no rush. Yeah. Embryo frozen, still okay. the unfreeze is the same quality. It okay. doesn't matter one day or ten years okay. or more. Just at the moment we can keep them yeah. up, up to ten years, but it's just okay. a low. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So embryos That's are fine. storage thirty years now, and they are absolutely fine. Okay. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Not yeah. here in England, I mean, because it's a low here, but and other yeah. other country they can keep it longer. Oh, okay. And there are pregnancies from longer frozen embryos. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's no harm for them. It's just, yeah, just you yeah. know why it's here in England is maximum 10 years. Yeah. So, okay, so when is the good uh, months for you to relax after the embryo okay. transfer a little bit or not too stressful minimum? Okay? Yeah, okay. I think yeah. I would like to start next month. So. Yeah. Absolutely good. Yeah. Absolutely good. So you have okay. this April when it's no hormone, everything comes down no. in your tummy, yeah. and then we okay. can start. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you will just sign that paperwork for the frozen transfer for us. Okay. okay. With the nurse. Okay. Yeah. They will send you the uh, by stock the tablets and the pessaries. Okay. okay. So you will be ready. Okay. And if you start the bank holiday weekend or before, doesn't matter because you have everything at home. You just need okay. a scan and then yeah. you can start. Okay. Yeah. Fine. So you will be yeah. ready. So are we signing forms today? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Fine. because you are here and then. Yeah. 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 And then if you start later, doesn't matter, we have the paperwork and everything and you have yeah. the, the tablets and the pessaries at home. Yeah. Okay? Okay. So you are ready Does to start. Does anything need to go in the fridge this time? No. Okay. I don't know. Ask the nurse please, but I don't think so. Yeah. Tablets and okay. the pessaries is not need. Okay. No the, rejection. The, the last week of waiting for the test, you were getting quite worried, weren't you, and stressed. Could that have made any difference? I was just getting a bit like, oh, should I test? Should I not? You're, you're getting oh, okay, really yeah. quiet worried about oh, okay. it. 
no. Bye. Yes, stress is not good, but anyway, it's it's not. So the embryo is good, the pregnancy is good. You can't okay. not do anything to okay. to have a miscarriage or something. Okay, okay. so don't fine. really don't burn yourself. Okay, okay. fine. So okay. We say don't run a marathon or do any physical job. If you do, it's still the pregnancy is good, it will be there, okay? Okay. If fine. it's not, then you can't do anything, it will be yeah. stopped, okay? okay? Fine, yeah. So really don't yeah. burn yourself. Okay. Okay, Please. fine. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And you know we have counselor if you need, yeah. okay? Yeah. So it's really it's very yeah. useful, okay? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Obviously, you can't do anything wrong. Okay. okay. Yeah. It's absolutely dependent on the on the nature on the embryo. So. Okay. okay. Yeah. That's fine. So yeah, we need a little help. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I know it's yeah. hard, but. Yeah. Yeah. So if you need, you you can call them and then. Yeah. Maybe okay. they can more help them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, You're that's back. fine. Yeah? yeah. Okay. So you will just sign the paperwork. Yeah. We send you the tablet. Everything. You will be ready when it's coming. Your period doesn't matter. You will just call us, or if it's a weekend, Harley Street. Okay. okay. Yeah. Fine. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much, Lisa. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Frozen transfer next, yeah. yeah. Um, so I've done you a treatment plan okay. for a frozen cycle. So it's very similar to doing a fresh. So you saying you call us when you start your period. Yeah. You come for that first scan day two or day three. So exactly the same from there. Yeah. Um, but obviously the medication is a lot different. So it's a lot yeah. easier on you doing yeah. a frozen cycle because it's just some tablets at first, and then you'll start the pessaries. Yeah. Um, so there's no injections, thank the Lord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so basically the, the tablets that we tell you to start after your scan just basically build up the lining of the womb. So we'll scan you probably two or three times during a couple of weeks. Um, so it's not as many scans as you had okay. for a fresh. Yeah. So you have two or three scans and what we're doing is just measuring the lining of the womb, just making sure that it gets nice and fixed so that when we go for your transfer that we've got a nice good bed for the embryo to hopefully get comfy in. Yeah. Yeah. So I've just printed this for you. So obviously you know you're entitled to counselling at any point you yeah. really need it. Um, so this just tells you a little bit again about it. To call us on, day, um, on the first half of your period for your first scan, you'll start what's called the prognova, which builds up the line of the womb. And then it will tell you about starting the progesterone, which are the cyclist pessaries, which you've done before. Yeah. yeah. Um, and you've got some numbers on there. So you can have a read of that okay. when you get home. Your consent form for your transfer. So just pop your details in, have a read through. I've put that you've got three here because you need to write in words. Okay. And you're going to have one forward and one put back. And then you just um, sign and fill out the bottom. So you can take that okay. home with you, but bring it back when you come back. There's no rush. Okay. Any questions? Um, I have got one injection left in the fridge. Yeah. And I've also got another one just on the side. Yeah. Am I still keeping those? Keep the medication, whatever okay. you've got. You've got no pessaries left, have you? Um, I do. I've got about a box and a half left. Oh, okay. So I'm going to order your medication today so it will get delivered so they call you in like the same as before. Yeah. Um, so I'll just minus one box of suction stuff, what you need. Okay. So that you've got enough. With regards to the injection, you won't need them this time and hopefully we don't ever need them again. Yeah. Um, but you never know. So yeah. keep it. If obviously they can go out of date, then that's different. If they've been opened, any injections, they're only valid for a month, okay. so they can go in the bin. But if they've not been opened, no. just keep them wherever they're supposed to go, and we can okay. use them in the future. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> any other questions? Um, we've got Lisa. Hi, Lisa. We've got the uh, box of um, old syringes and needles, whatever. Yeah. Um, it's quite far up in there. Yeah, you can bring that into us, or you can take that to a local pharmacy. Any sort of chemist that dispenses medications should be able to take it and dispose of it, okay. or just bring it in when you come in next to us and we'll dispose of it. Okay, thank you. Yeah. yeah. Okay. When's your period, Joe? Um, around the 30th of April. Okay, so you've got so I've got time. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> got a little rest before you go. Yeah. Although it's a lot easier doing a frozen yeah. transfer. Yeah, and I've spent since I heard it was no injection. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so nice. So just a couple of scans. 
it's, it's so much yeah. nicer. Obviously, you don't need the egg collection, so you just literally go for the yeah. transfer, which obviously you remember before. Yeah, it's really, it's really simple. Either, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a yeah. lot nicer doing the frozen. So, I think it makes you feel less stressed from the first place anyway, so you've yeah. got more chance of pregnancy anyway because you're less stressed. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah. And frozen transfer rates are really good, so they're more than 50%. So, okay. yeah, good. Yeah. 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 Thank you. You're welcome. But if you need anything in the meantime, obviously give us a call. Yeah. Otherwise, expect to call from Stalk for your delivery and okay. then just call us when your period starts. Okay, fine. All right. then. Can I bring this form yeah. back? Yeah, take that home and have a good read and then bring it back when you come for your scan. Okay, fine. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. Thank you very much. See you soon. Have a nice few weeks break. Okay. <laughs> At least you've got these to holidays. Yeah. Thank you very much. All right, you're welcome.